think tomorrow is going to be more sustainable than it is now. Like when I was thinking about what's the future for me, the future is family time, retirement, spending time with children, grandchildren. Paths and gardens and things all just sort of come to mind immediately. I'd like to make a theme park and some parks with lots of animals there. Everyone is just happy and stress-free. People are able to play outside and just being together and people getting together and being in a community. The roads to be really um, connected to people out there and easy to get around. Wouldn't it be great to have shuttle buses that could even pick up from the door at specific times, drop them back out? I think that there could be Lots of magno trains that are going everywhere. Train tracks above your head, above the city, that use magnetic power instead of electricity and using more yeah, coal. Having um, public transport running smoothly and on time would be amazing. And some buildings and maybe a very big, tall skyscraper. I'd put lots of buildings, schools, education centres so everyone would know. Mm, police, fire stations. Mm, and lots of shops. All the new infrastructure is super environmentally friendly. Every uh, building has solar panels on its rooftop by default. Basically I would love to see a 100% renewable energy source around town that can be fed back into the energy group that can be a, a flagship for other cities and other towns around Australia to go through. And something that sticks up out of the ground and cleans up all the polluted air. We know where development's going to go over the next 15 years and we have a plan for that. However, in the next five years, Council's going to need to decide where development will go beyond that. And Imagining Tomorrow is about establishing where growth is going to go in the long term. So West Toowoomba is part of that, looking at the Western Growth Front, uh, looking at how we're going to build detail into our planning for our short-term growth areas. The West Toowoomba area is experiencing unprecedented growth with the bypass, the airport, and potentially the inland rail. We need to make sure that we plan to make sure that we get the best advantage for those people who are going to live in the West Toowoomba area. Probably really precious that uh, we don't lose the individual character of Toowoomba. I think in keeping with you know the tradition and the aspect of Toowoomba which everyone values is, is lots of parks and gardens. I like small, smaller shops but more sort of community sort of living than just a big shopping centre. Learn from sister cities around the world that have uh, got it together so that we can then be able to have a really good community. We are planning for the long term future of West Toowoomba and we want to hear how you imagine tomorrow. We want you to work with us to make sure you understand what you want in 10 years, in 20 years, in 30 and maybe 50 years time. Just dream of flying into the Brisbane West Wellcamp Airport and tell us what you'd like to see as you were coming into land. So everyone would be happy.